Sources told NTV that the decision of who should be given the money has sharply divided who won the party primaries as NRM flag bearers and those running as independents. The latter say they deserve financial support because they have been contributing financially to the party as MPs. This afternoon, they met with the NRM Secretary General Amama Mbabazi at Takibwa Road. Sources also say he asked them to support President Museveni. Some sources indicate that the group which is led by Kabarole woman MP Margaret Muhanga plan to ask to be paid over 50 million shillings each if they are to pull out of the campaigns. Are being seriously wooed and bought with a minimum of 50 million. Yesterday I interacted with some of the NRMs who have not yet concluded that deal. That is the time. Either they give it or they don't step down. It's not a reward, uh, it's facilitation of party members uh, to campaign and to ensure that we secure victory on the 18th of February. And the party position, party policy at the moment, is to dialogue with them uh, and find a solution to this challenge. It's actually not NRM members of parliament, but flag bearers for NRM as a party are supposed to receive facilitation. I don't know what amount. We even received that facilitation in 2006. Personally, President Seven has rang me several times. I even told him, President Seven, I said, if ever I told you I have come to NRM, I will be lying. And at the moment, all NRM MPs are in State House in Tebe, where they are due to meet President Museven, who hopes to make a last appeal to the independents to step down. Sources indicated that they would be demanding monetary compensation before they can take this crucial step. Caucus will be meeting the, 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 His Excellency the President at State House and uh, uh, measure uh, to reflect on the progress we have so far made. So I urge Ugandans, any money that you see from the fingers and hands of NRM candidates, that is your money. Just eat it and vote them out starting on Saturday, Sunday and Monday because the money is going to be given tomorrow afternoon. So it is your time to eat. It is now or never. Also, on the agenda could be a discussion of the controversial cultural leaders bill currently before parliament.